Around these parts, there can only be one top dog. Hi. Hi there. I'm Kent Storman with Versatile Energy. And for now, at least, that's Kent. And then here are your drink tickets for... That's all? That's <laughs> it. That's all. The picture of an Albertan on a mission. It's Kurt Metzmiller, Versatile Energy. The goal to get his company's name on the fastest chuck wagon again. Last year, that cost $130,000, less than half the record $300,000 paid in 2012 when oil prices were much higher. It gives you a, a real good um, perspective across all the industries, not oil and gas, it's all of them. Construction, uh, financial institutes, everybody. Even before the bidding starts, Kent finds his man, two-time defending champ Kurt Benzmiller, but he won't come cheap. I hope that there's a little bit more positivity this year than there was last. So. You bring a big bag of money? <laughs> you don't. <laughs> <laughs> well, a splash of liquid courage, a tap of the boots, and with the talking done, it's time to walk the walk. So this is where the rubber hits the road, really? Yep. Do you have a, do you have a limit? Do you have a, do you know? Uh, ballpark. Yeah? Yeah, ballpark where I'm going to go. You're not sharing it? No, I don't know. I don't know what, I, I, I want to see what our competition is. First on the auction block, the champ. And with the slightest of nods, it's over. Thank you, sir. Thank you. 137. Final price, $120,000. That's a bargain then. A little less than last year, so... Yeah. With a few more dollars in his jeans, it's off to claim his prize. The auction pulls in about the same as last year, stalled like the province's economy. And if the polls are to be believed, waiting for a new government to kickstart it. Yeah, the better the economy is or the oil is, then the, the better we, we get supported you know, throughout the season. So from your standpoint, do you think change is a good thing as far as I, I think change is a good thing because right now, it doesn't matter if it's provincial or federal government, I think that we're just, at a, just in a bad place. The hope is that another win is in the cards for this team and that Alberta will soon be charging hard again too. It is the Duke of Newberry, wire to wire with his wheels on fire, Kurt Benzmiller. Albertans head to the polls on April 16th. Aaron Collins, CBC News, Calgary.